Welcome Capricorns, my Capricorn. <laughs> I'm back y'all with another video, another banging video for y'all. This is a weekly, this is going to be from November the 9th through the 16th. Alright, so stay tuned if y'all want to know what's coming up, what's going on for my Capricorns, alright? So, it's a general read, it may or may not resonate. Hopefully it does, and if it does resonate, good for you. It was for you, boo-boo. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right? Don't forget to share with your family and your friends. Mm-hmm. I need y'all to share and help get the word out. Help get this channel growing and flowing, right? Um, as well, guys, I want to let you guys know about the sale that I have going on with the reads, okay? So, today... It's going to be $20 um, for a mini read, all right? So, y'all can hit me up via email. It's going to be in the drop box below. I accept cash app as well as PayPal, PayPal, and I can invoice you if needed. Um, what's going on on the website, guys? The website has been reopened, okay? I had to shut it down for about a week because I didn't have any items to sell y'all because y'all sold me out, <laughs> Which was a good thing, but I had to get restocked. And I brought a new item to... I brought two new items to the site, okay? So, we got the money bag oil, guys. The money bag oil, yes. Yes, she's so gorgeous, y'all. This has real shredded money. It got a couple of herbs in there. Um, you know, everything to manifest prosperity and abundance, guys. You can check that out on the site. As well, I have that manifestation candle that a lot of people have been asking me about, guys. I got it now. They are handmade candles. I do handmade this candle, all right? And it is on the website as well. Um, as well, guys, for those of you who are looking for sage bundles, we got those over as well over there on the website as well as Palo Santo sticks, okay? So you can go check the website out after you watch this video, all right? And... See what, what you know if there's anything over there that you like all right new items will be added possibly every other week i'm gonna try to keep a rotation i'm gonna try to keep a rotation going on the website all right capricorns let's talk let's talk let's talk let's talk bubbles <laughs> One message is there for Capricorns for this week, November the 9th through the 16th. I don't have a song for y'all right now. It might be because I'm just now really just getting up. <clears throat> but I normally have like a song that Spirit wants me. The lyrics. It be the lyrics. <laughs> it's the lyrics for me. Okay, let's see. November 9th through the 16th for my Capricorns. All right, let's go. Oh, we got the emperor. Oh, y'all spying on somebody? Okay. Two of cups. And seven of cups. And the king of wands. And the five of cups. Okay. <clears throat> At the bottom of the deck, we have the Four of Swords and the Nine of Wands. I feel like you're tired of feeling guarded or like you feel like you have to check or you're tired of checking for something. Because I see y'all watching. I see y'all watching someone. It's like you're checking something. Like you're, you're constantly looking at something. The Emperor here is um aries is energy but nonetheless like powerful okay um in control and the emperor is the father card as well it could be like a father an uncle someone older that you could be watching Okay, that you're that you're spying. I want to say spying, but I'm trying to get. Why is the emperor here? Mm. 
Okay, we got the tower. I feel like you're gonna get some shocking news. Okay, we got the tower and the knight of cups. So yeah, this is definitely like some surprising news that you get. The empress is the mother card. Okay, so I'm not sure if this is a mother, father, um, or a aunt, uncle, baby mother, baby father. Yeah, you've been waiting for some news. Okay, the Seven of Pentacles and the Page of Wands is waiting patiently for some news to come in. Okay, so you've already been waiting, and that's what that's what I feel like you're tired of waiting to hear some news. Okay. Okay. So it looks like you guys are about to get some surprising news. Okay. Some surprising news is about to come in. Why is the tower here? Okay. The Four of Cups. The Four of Cups. And the Knight of Cups and the Page of Wands. So yeah. You've been waiting. This it just keeps saying that you've been waiting to hear back from someone about some news, okay? Yeah, because I feel like you don't know exactly the high priestess is here. The four of cups and the high priestess. This is saying like you didn't have any idea or you did you possibly are using your, you know, your intuition on this. Like you may feel like you're going to get some news, like some type of news coming to you. Why is the high priestess here? King of Pentacles, you guys' energy. Yeah. Okay. So, why is the Page of Swords? Yeah, like I said, the Hangman. You guys are waiting to hear, to see or hear something. Some type of news, okay? Something that you've been waiting on. It could be in regards to money. It could be in regards to um, something... You know, like some type of financial news or there's something here about an opportunity. Yeah, this has been on your mind. You've been thinking about it for a long time. Okay, so this is something that you've been thinking about. How you feel, okay, with the Ace of Cups. Yeah, and I'm getting like... I keep seeing this. This keeps popping out as well. But I'm hearing like you don't want to talk bad about this person or you don't want to seem like you're coming off as negative because you love this person with the lovers here. But is this is something that you've been thinking about. Like you've been thinking about this for a minute. Why is the Ace of Cups here? This is about how you feel. Six of Pentacles. Yeah, the sun. This could involve like a father-son thing. Especially with the sun card right here. I'm just hearing that. And I'm hearing this about a connection, okay? Because I got the two of cups here. This is a bond, a connection that you have. Okay, why is the Two of Cups? Give me, tell me more about the Two of Cups. The Knight of Cups keeps coming out. So now it's out. Okay, so. The Moon and the World. Okay. This could be definitely <clears throat> with the Four of Wands here and the Two of Cups. I'm getting this to be family oriented. Or for some of you, this could be you're waiting to hear news from a husband or a wife. I'm hearing that as well. Somebody here could be separated but still married. So there's still an attachment.
Going for seven of cups here. Yeah, you feel like you don't have any other choice but to wait to hear from this person or wait, uh, wait to get this news. Yeah, I'm I'm hearing like some of y'all are about to start fresh. I'm hearing start over. The world and the fool. That's like a you you closing a chapter and then starting fresh with the fool. Okay, so I'm hearing like you don't have any ill feelings with the death card and the five of swords this is saying like i don't feel no type of way basically you know what i'm saying the five of pentacles this is someone feeling left out or rejected i feel like you are closing a chapter okay maybe it's, there's something here that you had some ill feelings towards at one point in time but now you feel like you know the bond let's strengthen the bond okay let's i really do have a connection with with you and you know i'm um you know, willing to put some things to the side and we could close this chapter and start fresh. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. King of Wands. You could be dealing with the fire sign. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. See, yes, yeah, see, look at this. The Six of Swords and the Five of Wands. Like, you're getting over. You, this in the past, you decided that you were going to get over whatever issues that you and this person had. Yep, Two of Swords. Yeah. You don't want, you don't want all the lovers. Okay. So you don't, you don't, you no longer want to carry this. If you had animosity towards someone or a person, I feel like you're ready to put that to the side. Like I'm getting, why is the lovers here? You could be dealing with a Gemini. Okay. The lovers and the queen of cups pisces cancer scorpio the three of cups okay so you're reuniting with someone in your past could be a water sign pisces cancer scorpio a gemini and i got king of wands leo sagittarius aries all right so yeah i feel like you're tired of um You, I feel like, okay, because we got for future energy, we got the five of cups. Okay, so for some of you, you kind of feeling, kind of feeling bad about a situation or there's some type of regrets. I feel like you're tired of feeling that way. Like you're ready to put whatever this is, you're ready to put whatever issues you had dealing with this person to the side. Okay. For some of you, this is a separation. Some of y'all are separated. You're married and separated um i'm hearing that as well with the hierophant and the four of swords here and you're waiting to see what this person has to say like you're waiting i still see y'all are waiting for a response like i don't know if you guys going to be messaging i'm getting a lot of text messaging or video messaging social media on the phone but like i'm hearing like you're waiting to for someone to respond Waiting to see if this person is going to come your way or come towards you. And I'm seeing it as well, like, you're done. Ten of Swords and the Nine of Swords is saying I'm done being worried worried about this situation. I don't I no longer want to worry about this situation anymore. I want to feel good. I want to be celebrating. I want to have fun. I want to get together, have a good time. Three of Cups, Two of Pentacles. Some of y'all, somebody here is also worried about somebody cheating or juggling two or more things or whatever. Somebody here is worried about somebody stepping out or cheating. But I feel like somebody is saying that. I feel like it's you guys that could be saying that you're done with that. Like you're you're ready to work on something solid here with this three of pentacles and the ten of wands. Like, and you're not gonna quit. I feel like you're not going to quit. Yeah, see, 
the fool. Ten of Wands and a fool. Like, you're done with something so you can start something new. And then we got the King of Cups and the Ten of Cups. So it looks like there's going to be some type of happiness coming out of this, which is good. But I feel like, I, I feel like you guys are just like... You're being a grown-up about a situation. <laughs> More so like you're being a grown-up. You're being you're doing the adult thing. And I do see a lot of communication, a lot of chit chat and a lot of messages going on. Like you're communi you're in communication um with someone. Because I keep seeing you guys waiting on some type of response or waiting to hear something. Um and I do see like you're gonna be kind of surprised at what you hear or surprised at how they come towards you. Okay, I feel like there's a little twist to this, okay? So, y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao for now.